My coming out advice is just do it. Like, better out than in. And I know that there may be conflict, there may be difficult times, but honestly, living life in the closet isn't life lived. My advice for anyone coming out would be do it. It's way better than you think it's gonna be. Trust me, it's awesome. The first person I came out to was my childhood best friend, Kayla. Um, we were sitting in the park talking about deep, dark secrets, and I didn't even really know that it was like for sure that I was gay, but I was like pretty sure in the back of my mind that I was. Um, I just hadn't confronted it at all. And then, um, I don't know, one thing led to another and I ended up telling her that I was not straight, and then I cried the whole way home. Any advice I would think for young people coming out is tell someone who you really can trust. Don't be afraid to be yourself and don't be afraid to tell someone and be honest. Because at the end of the day, you will feel like a weight's been lifted off your shoulder once you've told someone. Even if it's your dog, just telling someone your dog's not going to tell no one or your cat. Kind of they can't speak, but you'll feel ten times better for it. Trust me. Once you come out, there is like this weight that is lifted off your shoulders. It's 2016. People don't have such a problem with it. Like, like you know, I thought when I came out, I would be ostracised. People would throw things at me. I thought it would be very dramatic. I thought I'd run away from home, join the circus, grow a beard, wear a lot of like flowing dresses. It wasn't like that. Literally, nothing happened. Nothing changed. I was the same person. I told my parents I was gay, and my mum goes, well, okay, cool, we're having pasta for dinner. I said, mum, you didn't hear me. I said, I'm gay, I can't eat carbs. So the first person that I came out to was, in terms of the show, was Chloe and she kept it a secret, obviously. But outside the show was my best friend, Victoria. I told her in confidence that I think I like boys and that I fancied a boy. She then went and told a girl who fancied me that maybe Nathan isn't into guys, who then ran out the toilet in a nightclub, which was busy, full of all my friends, and told everyone that I was gay. And I was too drunk to deny it, so I was just like, yeah, I am, and I didn't speak to my friends for two days, and then I turned around, went to college, and I ended up being the most popular kid there. So who was winning in that situation? Me. So thank you, Victoria. I feel very grateful that my mum and dad are so supportive. And then I just came out to the rest of my friends and family when uh, I was on Australian Idol. Everybody just was like, oh, there's, oh, that looks like Shane. Oh, that's Courtney. Oh, well, we Shane is a homosexual. We've just worked that out. My advice for any young people thinking of coming out, I would just say, take your time, do it when you feel ready and secure and when your environment around you, when you feel it's safe to come out, basically. And then, um, yeah, and then when you can, just do it and enjoy the rest of your life. So just do it. Because it's gonna be amazing. <laughs>